Hi everyone, this is Robin and I'm here with my son and we're making a card using the Create a Critter cartridge and my son has chosen to make the bear on page 27. We're not going to add the cute little dress, we're just going to do make it very simple and we've chosen dark chocolate brown for the bottom layer. You cut this with the chocolate. This layer we're cutting, we're using actually peach instead of a lighter brown and we're going to use layer one for the peach and then for the top part we're using this like caramel color with texture for the top part. Okay, so let's get started on that. Okay, we have our mat loaded in our Cricut and the first thing my son's going to do, well we've actually, what size is this? It's three inches. Yes, three inches. And so the first thing we're going to do is just keep it regular. <laughs> Sorry. The first thing we're going to do is make sure that your real dial size button is off. If you push your real dial size button, the layers are not going to layer up. They're all going to be real size. So make sure that's turned off and we always usually use the paper saver when we create crafts. First thing we're going to do is you're going to push the bear. So go ahead and push the bear. And if you want to wait and see that the bear pops up over here, you can check that out. Is that the bear? Okay, why don't you go ahead and press cut. There we go. Does that look about the right size? I think that's a pretty good size. We're doing three inches. Okay, now we're just going to move our blade over here. And this is the easy part. All you need to do is let's hit our layer one. That's a creative features button. And just hit the repeat last and cut. Thank you. What that's going to do is just cut whatever was on the same level that you cut the first time. And if you've just changed the creative features button, it'll just cut what's on that row if that was easy enough. Now we're going to hit line return, move this over here, and we're going to hit layer three, or layer two. Can you press the layer two button? Hit repeat last, and cut. Yay. Okay, let's put this card together. All right, we have our cute little bear. Is it a girl or a boy? Can it be a girl? Fine. <laughs> this is for your grandma, right? Okay. I thought it was for my grandma and grandpa. Oh, grandma and grandpa. Okay, that's fine. So we're just using a little bit of mono adhesive here on the bigger pieces. Da, 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 da. And then we'll use a zig two-way glue pen for the smaller pieces right here. Simple enough, right? Mm -hmm. da, 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 da. I love this bear. It's so cute. Whoops. Okay, now I'm just going to line it up here. Sometimes I think, here's a little trick with the Creative Critter, I think it's easier if I just hold it in my hand and kind of do this and then I squeeze it together. Does that look like it's a better fit? So if I got glue all over it, huh? Okay, and now we're going to do our final layer. Good choice color. Good color choice. Did I say choice color? <laughs> good choice color. You did good. Okay. And now just lay that on top or do the same thing that I had said earlier. Just kind of put it together. Do you like that? Don't you think the pink looks good and the, for the belly and the face? I'm not in the audience. Yeah, you can talk. <laughs> this is our video, right? Yep. Yes. Okay. Yes. Yay. Okay, so we've picked some bright colors here. We're going to start with a five and a half by eight and a half base. I need my little bone folder. Can you find it for me? Oh. oh. Pink one, preferably. Thank you, sir. Okay, fold this in. Sparkles. And it has sparkles. Yay. This is the Martha Stewart one. One of my awesome viewers sent this to me, like, over the summer, I think. I think it might have been before the summer. Okay, so now I have these here. This is a strip of paper. Let me see. This is by Cosmo Cricut. Cosmo Cricut. It's two-sided. And I'm going to use that right here. And this strip right here. This is four by five and a quarter. I use this size a lot. What we're going to do first is, this is a punch. <laughs> this is a punch. That's what it's called. This is a Stampin' Up! punch. And I'm just going to try to punch this in here. It's kind of hard at the angle that we're working with here, isn't it? There we go. Yay, I did it! Poor paper. Poor because I punched it. I'm sorry, paper. Okay, and that's going to go right here. Um, can you get our our awesome stamps that we're going to use? 
we're going to use one of the stamps from my new line and it's called the stamp set is called more punnylicious you know because we couldn't get any any more punny huh oh, oh. we couldn't get any punnier here you go so we're using, this is the sheet, I just pulled this out of the packaging. Using we're using bear hugs. Bear hugs, because Grandma loves bears, and so we're going to try to make this work up here. Teddy bears. You know what, we might just do, we might just need to use the little one right here. That's what we're going to do. This might be too long. Where are my scissors? We're going to get a little creative here. Don't waste it. I won't waste it. We're going to use that later. Okay, now I need some tape. Okay, now we have some ribbon here. And we can go ahead and put this together. It's going to be kind of simple a little bit. And that's my favorite type of card. We probably, we could have done this bear a little bit bigger, don't you think? Mm -hmm. But it's a good size. Okay, we're just going to finish this up. I just need a brown ink pad. Okay. All right. I know where I want my stamp to be. Okay, let's put this together right here. I need my pink A2G gun. Will you get that for me, please? I think it's on my desk. Hurry, hurry, hurry. No, it's right here. Oh, it's right next to me. Hurry. Thank you, Sunny. Sunny. I'm at Sun. Okay, here's my A2G gun that I painted. Do you want to know how or learn how um, Carly and I made a video? Just go to my videos or check out my YouTube page and you can find it. Okay, here we go, and we're going to do some strips here, strips here. Do you think your grandma and grandpa are going to like your card? It's they, well, you it's helped. There. It's their card, that's right. Okay, put this right here. Okay, I'm going to need your help just a second. Okay, I want you to go ahead and put some of these on the back. Just put like three of the dimensionals. These are from Stampin' Up! They're dimensionals. While he's doing that, I'm going to use a chocolate chip pad from Stampin' Up! Here, why don't you scoot over just a titch. And I am going to use the Bear Hugs! More Punnylicious! You can check out the new stamps on my products page on MyPinkStamper.com and you can see all of the retailers that carry my product and my stamps that were just released this week. So exciting. My newest stamp line. Okay, we're just going to put the bear hugs right here. Bear hugs. Oh, Grandma is going to love this. <laughs> okay, now we just need to take these off, okay? I'll take them off since you put a million on there. And we're almost done. Okay. Let's put this right here. Bear hugs. And let's add this in here. Perfect. Just the right size. Turn this around here. And I just need my scissors. What do you think? Let's just do this straight across. And this one straight across. Well, I almost did it straight across. Straight across. All right, there we go. Thanks for your help and your idea. Thanks, everyone. Bye. Bye. Bye.